Hello, brothers and sisters in Christ. Today is Thursday, February 25th. It's 4.35 p.m. Okay, this is just a quick recall video, uh, but it says there's seven people in the hospital from this. Uh, seven people in four states have been hospitalized. The title is there's a soft cheese recall for 17 products due to possible listeria contamination. The um, publication is called Self. Self.com. It was written by, um, it just says Health, February 23rd it came out. Okay, so I got this from uh, Tessa, Louis Garcia, oh, Adobe Stock. They just found this picture in Adobe Stock photos. It looks moldy, but I guess a lot of cheese is molded. It, they let it get moldy, and then they cut the mold off and package it. Anyway, there is a multi-state cheese recall due to possible contamination with listeria, a type of bacteria that can cause potentially serious foodborne illness. On February 19th, El Abuelito Cheese, that's A B. U E L I T O Abulito Cheese. Never heard of it. We called 17 different fresh and soft cheese products. After the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, or the CDC, reported at least seven cases of listeria infection in Connecticut, Mar Maryland, New York, and Virginia, potentially linked to Quaso Fresco cheese products. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. It's Q-U-E-S-O, Queso, Queso, whatever. Fresco cheese products from the brand. From the brand. I guess that would be El Abuelito cheese. All seven people were hospitalized according to the Food and Drug Administration, but no one has died. The El Abuelito cheese recall covers all of their Queso Fresco products with sell by dates through March 28th of 21 and spans seven states. That's a lot of cheese. Wait a minute. It spans seven states. I thought earlier it said seven people from four states. I guess they're covering their bases. Whenever this cheese was made, and wherever it was sold. The recalled products were distributed to supermarkets, wholesalers, and retail stores through February 16th. The recalled cheeses are sold under three different brands in various states. The El Albulito cheese brand in Connecticut, New Jersey, Pennsylvania, and New York. The Rio Grande fruit food products brand in Virginia, North Carolina, and Maryland. And the Rio Lindo brand in North Carolina and Maryland. You can see a full list 
of recalled products and their labels on the FDA page. And you click on the word FDA, it's highlighted in red. All the links are highlighted in red. So you can learn more about the cheese, more about the recall, more about the Food and Drug Administration, what Listeria infection is, the company, and foodborne illness. Okay? So I'll end it there, and I will put the link to this article in the description box so that if you bought soft cheese or any cheese product under uh, any of those names that I mentioned, you're going to need to look into this, I guess, or pray over your food, whatever you want to do. Cook it in something. I myself love cheese, but I stick to craft mostly or the store brand, but any of them could have this happen. So anyway, God bless each and every one of you. I pray you have a good night or good morning whenever you happen to see this. Okay, talk to you later. Bye for now.